creating roads. To create a road, an area and land shape for the road must first be selected. For landscape data, 3D land shape data files or paste map information, aerial pictures or satellite images can be imported. For Japan, 50 meters mesh altitude data and 2,500 space infrastructure data of Tokyo and Osaka are offered as default and available for use. Road horizontal line shapes can be defined on the land shape ground plan. Although freehand entries are possible, parameters such as IP coordinates and clothoid are supported for line shape variation points. Next, the road's longitudinal line shapes are defined. As definition of cross sections, there are options for bridges and tunnel areas, as well as the availability of road cross sections. In road generation, banking and cutting of the terrain according to the road line shapes can be created automatically. And banking and cutting according to the edited or loaded landform data are possible. When setting up cross sections, road surface, dividers and guardrails can be changed and the number of lanes as well as basic cross-sectional structures can be defined. These steps allow swift generation of roads and allow the performance of running simulations on the spot. Also, running speed, lane changes, oncoming vehicles, running vehicles and such can be configured. Horizontal crossings and overhead crossings. A road is created and then two intersecting roads are added to make horizontal and overhead crossings. The blue line represents the intersecting roads. The horizontal crossings can be generated automatically by roughly matching the height of the intersecting roads. Overhead crossings are configured as a bridge zone. There are also on and off ramp settings available. For the automatically generated horizontal crossing, the shape and road surface texture can be edited and the running route established. Running simulation in the generated 3D VR space is performed to check the road. Traffic simulation and traffic light control. Traffic simulation options for the created road are configured. Traffic simulation is ready to run by setting up traffic volume per hour initial speed and vehicle mix rate. High-speed generation using internal calculation is also available. Traffic light control is available by arranging 3D models such as traffic lights, surface markings and setting signal patterns. Creating Landscape the sign command allows diverse expressions with abundant textures and setup information. Arranging overheads and defining the height and shape of the poles are available. For road accessories, there are commands for adding delineators at the corners and wires to electric poles. And they can be easily added. The tree command offers bulk deployment alongside the road or the presence of several thousand trees at a selected location in one go with a forest feature. For more realistic trees, the 3D tree feature is available where the trees can be added as edited created or obtained from the DB. Future images of the street trees are also available. For buildings, the new building command or 3DS format model created externally can be used. For bridges and substructures, models can be imported from Forum 8's dynamic nonlinear analysis program UC WinFrame 3D. It is possible to zoom in and out, move up and down, move north, south, east and west and rotate the arranged models. These models and textures can be downloaded directly from the resourceful UC WinRoad DB on the web. Visual Options 
Generated spaces can have diverse expressions using the visual options such as wireframe views, transparent landscapes, time settings, weather changes with rain and snow, wind directions, wind speed, fog, clouds, compasses, and so forth. Useful options such as 2D view feature, cockpit, dashboard views, and more are available. In UC WinRoad Visual 3D VR spaces, real-time presentations can be displayed. In addition, a scripting feature allows automatic presentation and creation of animation captured movies using the AVI tools. Creating Roads